Good evening. My name is Joan Gallagher. I'm currently a member of the Nami Tribal Legislature. First, I want to thank you for allowing the Nami Tribe to participate in your governmental structure. I understand that you recently underwent a change and that it's my hope that the new governmental structure operates under honesty, integrity, and transparency for the betterment of all Michigan people. Acute, there's no denying that the Back 40 mine will change the landscape and the potential for the ecosystem along the Nami River. No one can argue that. And I have no doubt that the people and the property owners in that area are all going to be affected. From the exploratory operations, the construction, the blasting, the waste disposal, up until the closure, everyone's going to be affected. What will life be like for those property owners when when the uh, mine production is done on the final day when everybody packs up and leaves. All the damages and issues will be here remaining while those who made the money will be gone and you will be left with a changed landscape and have to be responsible for any potential cleanup because their mitigation funds are not sufficient. Does Michigan government care about the communities and the residents and the landowners that will have to remain in this area? Do you have a clear vision of a rehabilitation policy and plan that will leave everybody with the same pristine area that they currently exist? I know from one fact I have a concern. The Menominee tribe has entered into this fight. We had hoped that you would listen to the mines, to your taxpayers, but that fell on deaf ears. And I'm, I was stunned by that realization. But the Menominees are in this fight, and we will continue to fight in the white man's court. And we will do what is necessary to defend this area. Our cultural sites, our living areas, the cultural landscape, and other lands owned by individuals will, be, will permanently be destroyed by the back 40 mine. It is our obligation to protect and to preserve this area not just for our children, but for everyone's children and their grandchildren. Thank you. Thank you.